Life is full of twist and turns. Life is full of twist and turn. Twist and turn. Twist and turns. We are the children of God. Twist and turns. Twist and turns. Life is full of twist and turns. Smadu. Hello, children and children. In our today's lesson literacy, we are going to read a story about a birthday, Jerry's birthday. But before we start our lesson, I want us to sing a song of happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. to celebrate with her. Joki puts a bar of chocolate in her mouth. Kari says, Joki, please cut a piece of chocolate for me. Jerry gets the chocolate from her mouth. She cuts a piece and gives it to Kari. Mother takes the chocolate away from Kari. She says, Thank you, Joki. You are kind. Then she says, But you cannot eat this one. I will give you another one. Then mother gets a bar of chocolate from, from a tray. She gives everyone a piece. Then she says, Children, it's not good to give away chocolate that you have put in your mouth. Why, auntie? Joki asks. Mother says, Because if you are sick, it can make others sick. Okay, mother. Joki says. Then father says, We have enough sweets and chocolate for all of us. This is a story of a, a birthday party. And this birthday party is for Jerry. Jerry has a birthday party and Jerry is very happy. His cousins and friends come to celebrate her birthday. And Joki takes a bar of chocolates and put in in her mouth. Then Kari tell her to give her a chocolate. Then Joki removes that chocolate in her mouth and gives to Kari. After giving to Kari, then her, her mother takes the chocolate. And, and Joki asks, why mother have you taken that chocolate? Because it is not good to give somebody a chocolate that you have removed from your mouth. Because when you eat a chocolate that someone has eaten, you, if so, that person is sick, you can be sick. So you are not supposed to remove anything from your mouth. Then you give your friend to eat. Because that can make us sick. Then mother takes another chocolate from the tray and gives to Kari. And Kari says... Thank you. So you are not supposed to eat anything from your friend's mouth because if your friend is sick, you can also be sick. But you are supposed to share because when you share, share something that you have not put in your mouth. So that is the end of our story. And I want us to answer the question from the story we have read about a birthday party. And this birthday party is for Jerry. Now, from the story we have learned, what are the children doing? What are the children doing? What are the children doing? Question mark. What are the children doing? The children, what are they doing from the story? Yes, they are celebrating Jerry's birthday so the children are they are celebrating jerry's birthday they are celebrating 
Jerry's. Jerry's birthday. So the children are celebrating Jerry's birthday. Question number two from the story we have learned. Now, what does Jockey do to Kari? Ask for chocolate. What does does Jockey do do when Kari? When Kari ask, when Kari asks for chocolate, what does Jockey do when Kari asks for chocolate? What does he do? She cuts a piece and gives it to Kari. She removes chocolate from her mouth and gives to Kari. So she cuts a piece from her mouth. From the she removes chocolate from her mouth, then she cuts to Kari. So she cuts a piece and gives it to Kari. She cuts a piece. A piece of chocolate and gives and gives and give it to Kari. So when Joki when Kari asks for chocolate, Joki removes that chocolate in her mouth, then she cuts a piece of chocolate and give it to Kari. And we say you are not supposed to eat something that has been removed from someone's mouth. Because you can, when that person is sick, you can, you can also be sick. So you are supposed to share, but don't remove anything from your mouth, then you share with your friend. That is not good. Share something that you have not put inside your mouth. So you are not supposed to remove anything from your mouth, but you should share. Share first before you put inside your mouth. So after, after Kari asks for chocolate, she cuts a piece of chocolate and give it to Kari. Now, from the story we have learned, why is it not good to eat chocolate that has been put in another's mouth? Why is it? Why is it not good? Not good. Not good to eat. To eat chocolate. Chocolate that has been that has that has been put in another in another person's mouth in another person's mouth. Why is it why is it not good to eat chocolate that has been put in another person's mouth? Why? Why is it not good? Because if that person is sick, you can also be sick. So you're not supposed to eat anything that has been removed from one another's another person's mouth, then you eat. That is not good because you can be sick. So the reason it is because if you if you are sick, your your past, your your friend might also be sick. So because if you you are sick, it can make others sick. Because if you are sick, you can make others to be sick so don't remove something inside your mouth then you give to your friend because when you are sick also your friend might be sick
So sharing is caring, but share things that you have not put inside your mouth. Now, what is what was the story about? What was the story about? Can you tell me what was the story about? Jerry's birthday. Yes, the story was about Jerry's. Or oh, the story was about a birthday party. The story was about a birthday. A birthday. A birthday party. It was about a birthday party. And the birthday party was for Jerry. Now, I know you have understood the way you're supposed to answer the question from the story. You read once more the story and you answer the questions. And I wish you all the best. I wish you all the best. Until next time, children. Bye-bye for now.